I've had a few people ask me similar questions on my TYT MD380 programming video uh, basically asking me about how you actually use the radio after you've programmed it up in the way that I showed in the video so in this video I'm just going to show you how to do that uh, basically here I'm on a simplex channel but it will be the same on a repeater so if you're listening on let's say slot 1 of the repeater and someone else which is going to be basically just simulated by this radio here calls up on one of the talk groups that you've got programmed into your group list then it will come up on the screen of the TYT with the talk group name and you'll hear their audio coming through the speaker so I'm just going to demonstrate that now with the other radio here so let's say you're listening to your radio someone starts talking on this talk group and you see it and you want to talk back to them as long as you talk before it goes off the screen you'll be able to talk to them straight away so this person unkeys now and it's still on the screen if you talk before it goes off you'll be talking to that talk group without having to do anything else if you wait too long and it goes off the screen then to be able to talk back to the talk group you have to go into contacts okay and then you have to scroll down all the way to that talk group which I've got right here then you can key up on it from here and the other person will hear you on the same talk group it's the same thing for if nobody is talking and you just want to be able to go and talk to someone on one of the talk groups you go into the menu go into contacts contact again then you scroll down to whichever contact or talk group you want to be able to talk on and then you just hit the push to talk button and you're talking on that group so it's pretty simple once you know how to do it i hope that answers the question for you guys who asked me that on the video and thanks for watching